Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to all of you incredible manifestors. My name is Cabrini Schneider. I am the inner core coach. I help you get to the inner core of who you are by using Cabrini's law of fuck that. That's right. Fuck that stands for finally understanding common knowledge. Things happen all the time in life and in business, good and bad. So why not do what you want to do and stop doing what you don't want to do? Because things are going to happen anyway. Welcome to day 19. Woo. I'm telling you, time, I keep telling you guys, time is flying and it is not waiting on you. So today is, the topic is how to be grateful. Hmm. I want y'all to just sit with that for a minute. How to be grateful. Well, I'm actually going to talk about how to be grateful on the journey and how to be grateful for the bad times too. How to be grateful, actually if you think about it, the contrast, the bad situations, the things that go awry, are really the things that get you to what you want. See, because if you're sitting around just being complacent, you have everything handed to you, then what do you have to be grateful for? What do you have to want for? A lot of times you find yourself wanting for something because of something you don't have. So being grateful in the moment of where you are, where you can just stop and say, you know what? Thank you. Thank you to the universe and the God you serve. You know, sometimes you're just complaining the whole time and complaining about what you don't have and where you want to be and you don't realize that it's, hello, it's you. It's your responsibility to know what you want. You know, when I set out to create Cabrini's Law, fuck that, what do you want? I said, let me go and do a poll and ask people, well, what do you want? I'm asking you too, what do you want? Do you know that 75% of the people that I talked to did not know? Not only did they not know what they wanted, they didn't know who they were at their core, let alone why they wanted it. So Cabrini's Law Fuck That has three core questions and five principles. And today, on day 19, I'm just talking with you about being grateful with where you are right now. Because right now, you just might be on the journey to you. I don't know who I'm talking to. But you might be on the journey to you. If you are not, or if you are on the journey to you, or if you already know who you are and what you want and why you want it, be grateful too. This is just a reminder. And if you are grateful, good for you. Tell somebody else to be grateful. Share the love. So those of you that I am talking to that forgot to be grateful, that's okay. We're going to start right now. Take three to five minutes today. Look at yourself in the mirror, the image and likeness of God, and say thank you. Say, you know, I'm grateful for my pillow. Oh, girl, let me tell you. There's nothing like having a good pillow. I'm going to tell you. There's nothing like having a good pair of shoes. There's nothing like having a good meal, like a good old steak. I, and, and here's the other thing, too. Top ramen, don't sleep on top ramen. Even though I would never suggest you do that, but get some onions, dipe some onions and put up. Be grateful for the things that you can have to, to add to the things that you currently have. So that you can start opening up your mind and broadening your perspective of where you want to be. So, today, be grateful. How to be grateful. Now, okay, okay, okay. Was that you asking me? Was that you? How to be grateful? Okay. Sometimes you might not know how to be grateful. Let me tell you how. Sit down. Take a deep breath and say thank you. 
Can you imagine you just took a deep breath? Now, how did you do that? that you, you could be grateful right now from the head to the toe just for that. Do you, I, I, you know, this is, I, <laughs> I have conscious conversation with you guys. And sometimes when I'm talking with you and I'm sharing um, a topic of the day, it reminds me too how powerful we are. That we have this brain that I'm brainwashing you to believe in you. Remember, I'm selling you on you, right? That we have these powerful vessels that 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 I'm not thinking about moving my arms like this. It's just happening. I'm not thinking about what I'm thinking about saying to you. It's coming through me. This is all about being grateful for all of that. What? I mean, think about it. You could be grateful for the fact that you go to get your hair cut and it grows back. How the hell does that happen? There's not a whole bunch of brain hair, uh, hair inside of your brain that's, that's sitting in there waiting to come out. It keeps coming out. What are you, what are you grateful for? What are you grateful for? Hold on, y'all. I got some notes. Hold on. Yeah. You know, um, my partner just gave me this because, you know, sometimes I get, she got to give me some notes because, you know, I I'm, I get so excited. We get so excited about talking to y'all. She just reminded me that old folks, you know, old folks back in the day used to say, I woke up in my, right, I'm saying in an old folks voice. I woke up in my right mind and I have all my mental faculties. Did your grandmama used to say that when y'all grew up? You know, it, it's, it's something to think about, you know, as we are moving in this new space of, of, of new awareness of who we are. You know, um, there's so much to be grateful for, but I want to start with this amazing vessel right here have you thought about just being grateful for the vessel the body vessel right there's nothing more powerful than the body vessel because the body vessel is what gets you to all the things you want so maybe we'll start with the body vessel right think about it be grateful i mean you know you have lips for which to kiss someone you love right that's something to be grateful for you have eyes in which to see someone you love, right? So you have a nose in which to smell the one you love. Now, whether or not they smell good or not, ain't my, that ain't my business. <laughs> but so today is just about being grateful, just stopping for a moment on day 19 and just being grateful for the fact that um, we have this amazing body vessel. And then everything else is icing on the cake, right? Um, yeah, that's all. That's it. I don't even want to talk about no business, no, uh, none of that. I want to talk about being grateful for the body vessel, right? And then, ooh, so tomorrow I'm going to talk to y'all about being grateful, how I'm grateful for my body vessel. That's going to be a good one. I love you. I love having conscious conversation with you. I love talking with you about how you can be, do, and have whatever it is you want. Be grateful for the body vessel, right? And then when you're grateful for the body vessel, all of your brain starts opening up and you start thinking of things that you could have that you would never have thought of because that's how God works through you, right? So, all right, um, what else? I will put my book and my t-shirt line, all that same chitty chitty, no, that's not chitty chitty cha cha. Same information will be there for you because when you're with me, it's not about me. It's always about you because you're with me. I love y'all in that huge agape way. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Oh, remember to make this day the best day because that's all you got right now. I love y'all. Bye. There's my clicker. Okay. Bye. See, sometimes, look, I'm grateful for this clicker.
But sometimes, maybe it's because I'm not supposed to go. Ah, no, bye. <laughs> bye, y'all.